Hey y'all, welcome back to My Real California Life. It is Wednesday. Yep, I had to think about that for a second. So, I hope y'all are having a great day. If you're new here, I'm Sandra. Thank you so much for coming to check out my channel. I hope that you will enjoy it. And you are here, so I hope you will consider hitting that subscribe button. Hit the bell right next to it, that way you get notified whenever I upload a video. And give me a big thumbs up and leave me a comment. I love talking to you guys and hearing from you guys. So first I apologize. I know I have absolutely nothing on my face and I have this nice, oh, just amazing little visitor and it's just driving me crazy. You know, it's like right there on your lip that hurts. So, but I actually just got out of the shower a little while ago and I thought, you know what? Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a little video because my February Allure box came. Yes, just a couple days ago I got my January Allure. So you guys are never going to believe. I mean, obviously from the title I probably put something about the Allure, but they had said, like they still owe me a tote from when I very first signed up like nine months ago. And if y'all don't know, like I've been going through so much with them for the last couple months. Like I said, I just got my January box like a couple days ago. There's just been tons of problems. And they had said, you know, please allow a little bit of time that I was going to be getting an extra two. I was going to be getting two gifts. And they were reissuing my tote, but that would take six to eight weeks. Okay, so my February box comes today. And then this random bag. And the funny thing is, is it's addressed to me or the current resident and I was like okay well that can't that must be like maybe it's just a random sample that probably like something for a homeowner or something okay I open up this bag okay hold on let's see what did I just do I'm so sorry yep it's behind the tablet one sec <laughs> Okay, in my January Allure box that I just got, I got this sample, which is like a really good size sample. So for my gift to make up for all my troubles, I get a little tiny one of this. Do you see this? You just sent me a big one. That's like... I am blowing away, seriously, like I really think I am going to cancel Allure. Yeah, this stuff's really good, but I've been cutting back anyways, and I'm just, it's not worth it. Their customer service is garbage, like seriously garbage. So I got this, which is the Mika Nourishing Mask for your hair, um, 0.7 fluid ounces. As to where, like I said, the sample that I got in my January box was 2 fluid ounces. So I am going to actually... If you've been here, you know I said that um, we have a family friend or a friend of a family who lost their house in the Paradise Fire and her and she takes care of her adult daughter. I was going to put together a little box for each of them, kind of just like, you know, some new makeup and just like face wash, mask, just kind of like do a little makeover thing. So I've been getting those together. I have my two boxes. So, um... I will show you guys real quick. I actually thought, perfect, I'm going to go ahead and throw that in. The other thing was, I'll tell you, do the other thing. Okay, you think that I thought that one was small? This is the other the other thing they gave me. So these are my two gifts, I'm assuming, for to make up for all my problems. So this is a Black Rose Skin Infusion Cream, Plumping and Radiance. Daily face care helps restore the elasticity of more youthful skin reinforces the luminosity and freshness of the complexion intensely moisturizes okay well that's a little odd but let's see i have one see i got so we got a lip mask an eye mask the what is this called tlc sakari baby facial and then i have another face mask and a hair mask and then I have a little mini makeup revolution palette and there's a mascara a lip gloss and the Mac highlighter that's just in a makeup bag and that's just one of the boxes and I'm still gonna put more stuff in actually I think that I'll put the hair mask in that one yep okay and then um, the other one sorry has a lot more stuff I have text 
free style texturizer for your hair, um, a shampoo with avocado and a styling gel. Sorry, I wasn't even showing you guys how I'm sorry. Just, oh well, this is kind of quick. This is what I'm giving to them anyways. A hair mask. There's a um, bronzer and highlight palette, a face scrubber, a mascara, some balm, the Way volume spray for your hair, and an NCLA nail polish. So this is what I have for them so far, just for their little, like I said, just kind of, you know, makeover fun boxes. So that's cool. So let's see. Also, I got a couple of the Walmart winter boxes. If you don't know, on top of their normal, like, subscription boxes that they did they did like 10 boxes or something that they were each like 10 bucks and one was like lips one was mascara one was this one was that so i did go ahead and get a couple of those i got glow like a pro because i thought it was super sorry because i thought it was super cute because it had these little ones and in all honesty i thought these were going to be just little samples because it was ten dollars so i ordered it online like a while ago when i ordered my husband's valentine's day present so the funniest thing is though I ordered this one for me like I said there was like eight of them for, were for girls kind of more and two were for guys one was a shaving and one was Mr. Dashing so it was like shampoo and stuff so they were all ten dollars I thought they were going to be the same right so I got this one I got my husband Mr. Dashing okay it came in the mail you guys look at this here's the Mr. Dashing and then here's mine. Look at, is that not the craziest? Like, I was like, 10 bucks? Are you kidding me? Like, this is so worth the $10. I mean, even this is worth, but I'll show you guys real quick. It also has primer, which I love primer. So I like that it, you can open it up and see what's inside. So we have an e.l.f. primer, a Maybelline Master Primer, and it says primer and base. And then a, the brand is found and it says stardust illuminating makeup setting spray and then these last two are hard candy which that's crazy when i was like in high school hard candy was um like a nail polish brand and it was like more of like a like skater rocker grunge per se you know kind of um what would I call it? Like ska, I guess back in the day we called it. Kind of like how like Gwen Stefani was back like in No Doubt. Anyways, but those are hard candy. This one is a matte. It says, the funny thing is it says matte sheer envy setting spray. Oh, okay, never mind. 12 hour wear and hydration. But it's matte. Okay, I don't know. Anyways, and then this one is actually a body luminizer. And it's really pretty. It says head to toe skin glow and then you have a little milani blush and a little milani highlight so i thought that was actually really really cute i like that the milani blush was shaped like a flower too and i know milani doesn't cost a lot anyway so it's not like this box box was super expensive but i did want to like i said try a couple of these things and i ordered them a while ago so let's see real quick we're just gonna check this out Okay, if I can get it. Sorry, guys. So, actually, the e.l.f. Poreless Face Primer is a pretty nice size bottle. Like, and it's, I like that it's like this frosted plastic. And actually, it looks like it's kind of pink. I don't have anything on my face, like I said. So, I'm going to actually see. Oh, okay. Never mind. I lied. I probably should have, like, shook it. Oh, that's my dog. Hold on one second. Sorry, I should have shook it because it came out like a little bit of cream with like the liquid. But so far it was really liquidy and it actually smells really like, actually really like eucalyptus, which was weird. I was almost going to say that it was kind of like, I don't know, I thought kind of alcohol at first, but then I smelled it's like definitely eucalyptus. Okay, I shook it. Let's see. There we go. So it is a... Uh, but do you see it's still kind of doing that? That's kind of weird. Um, but yeah, I'll be happy to try that. It does feel definitely like moisturizing. You know, it doesn't... I don't know. I really like that actually the way it feels. So I'm happy to try that. Now, the other ones... 
it actually now that I'm getting rid of that like wow that is just really weird because it's a really good smell but it's like you know that that helps like almost like clear your sinuses wow that's really weird okay so the other things I'm honestly probably gonna give away so Maybelline Master Prime by Face Studio Primer and Base. I don't know what that means. Visibly smooths, prime skin with hydration, lightweight formula, wear alone or under makeup for comfortable wear. I honestly will probably do that in a giveaway also. So there's that. And then again, we have the Found Stardust Illuminating Makeup Setting Spray. It's like one of those, you know, things in it, which I don't know if, how safe that is. Shake well, hold bottle 8 to 10 inches away. I actually, hmm, maybe we'll see. I want to see how illuminating it is. Okay, I do see you're probably not going to be able to really see. Oh, maybe a couple little sparkles. Let's see. I sprayed it way too close with the primer look it's like not do you see how funny okay but I'm actually now obviously I'm gonna keep that one okay and then we have the two hard candy things real quick let's see so hard candy just glow body luminizer head to toe glow what is it let me just see it's not like in a seal or anything oh yes it is so I'm not going to, okay, I see it's like a squirt. So it's just like my Ebonema Sunset Glow Oil. Yeah, basically. So I'm going to, I'm glad I didn't open it because there is a sticker holding the lid on. So I'm going to actually give that away also. So we're going to put that with the little primer. And then the other one is a sheer, MB, another setting spray which I have a setting spray that I just got from Makeup Light Revolution, so we're gonna put this in a giveaway too. So cool, those two little card, the little hard candy things can go together. Actually, that'll be cool. They'll all, we'll put them all together kind of because we got a primer, a setting spray, and a luminizer. So that is cool. Put those for something, and then I will keep this little highlighter and blush just because these are super duper duper cute. Sorry, you guys, I know it's so loud. Okay, now I don't, like I said, I don't have anything on, so I probably will throw, if I could get this opened, let's see. Oh, it has a little like perforated spot. Hello, Sandra. Mm. So look at you guys, is this not, what's the color? Rose powder blush, romantic rose. Okay, that is really pretty. And look at how it's like a rose. Is that not so cute? Ooh, I can use my new brush, my new Farrah Puffy brush that I got, that I ordered from Ipsy. Okay, you guys. Oops, I was probably supposed to pull it up, but it's okay. Since I don't have anything on, we're going to go ahead and try a little bit of it. Yeah, so. I feel like... My cheeks are really red, so, and I don't have anything on, so I don't really know what's going to happen. But you just, it's definitely picking something up, but since I, I probably should try it, you know, when I have something on my face, because it's going to be kind of hard. Now let me kind of, ooh, it's really soft, though. Let me see if I can swatch it. It's kind of, ooh, I just put that primer on, huh? There it is a little bit. So you can see it is kind of, it's not really a pink. It's kind of like a nude blush almost, you know, but that would actually be a really nice like eye base is what it would be really good to like throw down as like a transition or something, especially if you had like a palette that was like all shimmers and you needed a color, this would be perfect, but it's cute obviously. And I'm going to keep it. And then we have the little highlight. So let's see. I don't have, I love highlights. If you've been here, you know, I love highlights. So let's see if Milani can glow. And this is Afterglow Strobe Light. Um, get, 
Oh, it is really pretty. It's like a shell almost is what it reminds me of. And then let's just see. Is it? Yep, we'll see. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is a nice little glow. And I didn't do, you know, a whole, whole lot. Let's see. Yeah, it is definitely a nice little shiny glow, even though I am like already kind of shiny there. But that is really pretty. Ooh, ooh, nice little highlighter. Cute and a nice little like travel, you know, a little small size. So that's cute too. Okay, I will show you guys real quick. I know I said we're going to do the Allure box, but I'm going to show you guys my husband's real quick. Is that not so cool? So in theirs, in the, it's the Mr. Dashing. They got a whole size deodorant and it's the gel. And then this is a two-in-one shampoo and condin conditioner. And it's um, for sensitive skin too, a fresh blend. And then a body wash, the same fresh blend, a classic scent of fresh citrus and crisp woods. And then this is a volcanic clay face wash. And then there's a barber grade high hold texture and then a hair clay and they're all like full size. So I was like, how freaking cool for $10. Are you kidding me? Especially like the size comparison of the box. That... So that was actually one of my husband's Valentine's Day presents and it just came. So he liked it though. And then I'm still waiting because when I renewed my Walmart box, I got him another one that was like a shaving one not these boxes it was like this reusable mesh bag um so I'm still waiting on that and then I got him a headlamp so because if you don't know my husband is an elevator mechanic and I got him actually two new headlamps that are 80,000 looms each and instead of taking AAA batteries like normal little headlamps that you can buy do these ones take the same as like the laptop batteries and they're rechargeable so he really liked that okay so if you don't know a lore change that used to be obviously in these boxes this red box came each month this is what it was but now you get it in just a box like this and when you open this up it's a nice little like reusable bag last month was the first month they did it which was january's box and it was red so february's is black and i do have to say i like the black better so that is cool so let's see um it says a 25 dollars gift use code allure 25 at checkout so there must be something um offer valid through 10 or 12 31 at gorgiana i don't know what this is so we'll have to I'll have to check it out there's probably other restrictions may apply which I thought okay so let's just see so there's always a beautiful person and it's gonna tell me what's in here actually so I'm not gonna look so like I said I it's this weird plastic that reminds me I don't even know what it reminds me of almost like the raincoats when we were kids like that you could get like the cheap raincoats I don't know it definitely reminds me of like the 80s or 90s but it is a really cool, cute little reusable, I have a hair in my face, I'm sorry you guys, reusable bag. So first things first, I have a face mask, which if y'all have been here, you know I'm like deathly afraid. I have never done like a sheet mask. For some, it just scares me, like the thought of having it stuck to my face, I don't know. But I do want to try, I do have a whole bunch like building up, I keep them in a box up there, but then I also have given so many away. Recently actually my... 500 subscriber giveaway winner Carol it took me like an extra week to mail out her box so I put in like an extra five face masks or something into a makeup bag for her because I had a whole bunch because I'd already given her some too anyways totally off subject but flower lab essence max mask pomegranate so I may have to try that that actually looks really really pretty and I love pomegranate and I love flowers like roses and stuff so that's cool we'll go afterwards to see Okay, next. Oh, wow. This feels... Yep, something leaked. Oh, man. I was just realizing when I turn, when I turn this to the side, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it, 
there you go see right there I could see that there was something all over it and I realized it's like sticky now I just pulled this out and I think this is what it is <sighs> hopefully it's not too bad inside but it's the the Mammond Mamondi Petal Spa Oil to Foam Flower Rose so it must be some kind of soap that's like a oil but then it turns to a foam it smells really good like roses, but it is sticky, and um, I hope it's not all over everything. Okay, I don't think so. You know what? I'm going to dump this stuff out. I'm sorry, you guys. Hold on. Wow. Wow. So, wait. Okay, I had already pulled out two things. Go out there with Daddy, please. Please, Bob. You know, I Horace has a stiff neck. Yeah, he was dancing around this morning and like pulled a muscle in his neck. Go out there with daddy, please. He's been like taking it easy all day, so I know. He just barely got off the couch actually and started walking a little bit, so the ibuprofen's helping a little bit. But anyway, so I got two things, two, four, six, and I have six more things in my lap. So anyways, it wasn't too bad in here. It looks like if it did leak, it just started and it was just a little bit came out the side. So that is okay. So actually, I'm going to, there's so much stuff that I'm going to get this because I don't know anything about what's going on. So the petal oil, um, it's the, the full size is $21 and it is a face wash. So it's an oil to a foam. And then we have this. It looks like there's a, they do two, four, six, there's seven different kinds. So they are $7 each. So that's cool. And then next, I have a brush. I don't think I've ever gotten a brush from Allure. See, I'm like, I'm going to cancel. And then they have a super good... I feel like that's like they know. They know that they can be crappy, you know, and have crappy customer service because the stuff they give you is so good, you're going to want to stay anyways. You know, that's what I kind of feel like. Okay, but this is, a, this is a Moda Metallics Triad Eye Brush, and it is $4.99. So, I'm sorry, I was trying to get it out. Look at that. It's a nice gold. It's really weird, like a... Here, so it's like totally textured. And it is an eye brush. It's kind of weird because it's like a triangle. I don't have one like this. That's really, really cool, actually. It's a little stiff, so... But it might be really good, actually, for like... Ooh, it might be really good for doing the inner corner. Ooh! Ooh, look at that. Oh, I'm happy. Okay, that's going in my brushes. Way to make me eat my words, Allure. Okay. So, next, actually, in the first page, I'm seeing, are you kidding me? I haven't watched what I was getting. This is crazy. Now, this is the Wander Beauty, which I have the original. Yep, it is full size. Oh, my gosh. And this says retails for $26, so this must be a new one. The Mile High Club Volume and Length Mascara. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, I love that other one, that Wander Beauty. So this is awesome. Just a plain or just a, you know, flat brush. I don't think the other one is like that. I'm pretty sure the other one's curved. Let me see. This is their original one, but this one's amazing. Yep, see this one has a little bit of a curvature to it, you can see, and that one's straight. So, and that, that one's actually not as big as this, like the bristles aren't as long, but I am really happy to try that, so I will try that and let you guys know. Ooh, that's exciting. And that's $26, wow. Okay, so next I guess we got a Model Co. Metallic Eyeshadow Trio, and this is $15. And I guess the color is Mykonos. You guys, this is actually... The only other time we've gotten like a palette was the little one from... Um, well, I mean, since I've been getting it for the last nine months, was the little one that Nikki Tutorials did with Juvia's Place. So this is just a little three color, but it is really cute. You got, oops, your light, you know, and yeah, it is all shimmers, but that's actually really, really cute. Um, I do have so many eyeshadows and I have so many palettes on the way that I'm going to stick this. This is perfect to go into one of those boxes because 
One has an eyeshadow palette and one only has the contour palette. Let's see. This is the one that has the contour palette. So this, that's perfect. Now she has an eyeshadow and she can actually use the contour palette as a base color for those shimmers. Perfect. So that's awesome. Okay, next. The brow gal. Wow, I think this might be full size too. The Brow Gal, the Instant Tinted Brow Gel, and I was thinking I may need to start doing some, so a tinted gel might be nice. And it says the price is $22, and it is, it doesn't say a color, oh, brown hair. Wow, let's see, okay. All my dogs are coming. Okay, does it have fibers? Yep, it does have microfibers. Okay, look at that. Let's see. I kind of like feel like over here they're looking a little a little thin. I have never done this in my life, so if it ends up looking like caterpillars curling up across my face, like bear with me cuz like I said I'm new to this. I'm just trying to put a little hold bit on. Okay, hold on. So, wow, hmm. I really like that though, actually. And that's $22, I'm pretty sure that this is a full size. So, now we have Mally Eye Color Shadow Stick. Didn't we get one of these last month? Hold on, tell Donnie to come, one second. Watch out. Sorry, you guys, one sec. Babe, you need to help him. I'm right in the middle of recording. Sorry. Excuse me, dogs. Okay, I was like, wait, I just got this, and I swear it's the same color, and it is. Hold on. That's not even in here, so maybe that's one of their gifts. Uh-oh, now did I just mix them up? No, that's the one that I used. That's the one that I didn't. Okay, so that's the brand new one, obviously, so I have two of them. That will be another thing that I will put aside for a giveaway. Come on. And like I said, I don't think that I see that, so that must be one of their things, yeah. Because it looks like then the last thing was you could have got a lip pencil a eyeliner or a Mally High Shine Liquid Lipstick. And I got the Mally High Shine Liquid Lipstick, which is awesome because this is $21. Are you kidding me? Okay, so I will show you guys, though, the, the brow or the metallic. You can see that this was mine because that I wrote because it's, like, all over it. Anyways, but that's that Mally Shadow Stick that I was telling you guys I just got so let me show you it's really pretty so I don't know why like I said I got another one that's not on the paperwork so that must be one of their like gifts but okay I got the Mally um like I said liquid lipstick it looks like it could have came in two colors like a pinky and then this nude which is nude light let's see oh it says liquid lipstick but it looks like a look at the brush okay do you see the brush those little hairs it's like flying away okay I've never seen a liquid lipstick like that I was thinking it was a gloss hold on the liquid lipstick by makeup artist Mally Roncal is rich and creamy and glossy it covers lips in luxe shiny color it looks more like a highly pigmented gloss than a traditional liquid lipstick, which means you don't have to be as precise when you put it on. You'll get one of five shades in your box. They range from pink to burgundy, but you all have one thing in common. They're really good at making your lips appear fuller and sexier. Okay. So, I've never tried that. However, I am... I did just get this nude color from Ofra, and I don't wear a lot of nudes, so I'm probably going to put that aside for a giveaway also. So we're going to put the Mally Brow and the Mally Lippy 
probably actually not for a giveaway, excuse me, in the box for the women who lost their house in the fire. That's going to be another awesome thing. So I think between all that stuff, their boxes, I still got all this stuff, like I said, to add to their boxes too. So I think between all this, they have a quite awesome little, you know, makeover boxes and some really cool new makeup to play with. But I got, you know, quite a bit of stuff that I'm keeping. I can't believe this allure. See, I'm like, I'm going to cancel. And then they go, like I said, and have good the brow gel. And that's, like I said, full size. The full size Wander Mascara. The Petal Spa Oil to Foam Face Wash. The face mask. The brush. You know, that was, the brush was super cool. And then the shadow stick. The eyeshadow trio. And the liquid lipstick that I mean that's just craziness and it's only $15 a month see that's what I'm saying I feel like they know that they can have crappy customer service because for $15 a month you get all that amazing amazing stuff to try so it's like what are you really going to complain about so I hope you guys enjoyed sorry I know that was a lot but those oh sorry one more thing I actually went to Walt Walmart. I went to Walmart. Sorry, I went to Marshalls. I have not been to Marshalls in seriously legit like years and years. But I didn't I wasn't gonna get makeup. I would never like I didn't need any palettes. And honestly, like I guess if I saw something cool, however, I will tell you guys stop. I got wipes. They were such a good deal. And I just have to tell you. I was looking for brush cleaner. That's what I wanted because I got this one a couple months ago in my boxy charm, and I love it. And this is one of the ones I can like spray my brushes, clean them, and then use them again really quick. They only take a couple minutes to dry. So I didn't find any brush cleaner, but I did find these called Wipeout, and they're brush cleaner wipes. And in here is 24 individually white, individually packaged wipes, and it says it cleans the brushes of makeup and oil between uses, and you only have to let it sit three to five minutes. So I thought that was really cool, and they were only $2.99 a bag, so I grabbed two of them. I think they only had a couple, but um, I like using makeup wipes and having them out here in here at my desk. I got these at Morphe. They were $6. They smell amazing, but that's way too much. I just grabbed them because I needed them while I was there, honestly. So I got Spa Scriptions was a two-pack. Each of them have 30, and it was only $2.99. Oops, excuse me. So one of the packs is brightening, and one of them is pore refining. So I'm super excited to try those. And then this was another double pack. Each has 30, and these are the charcoal wipes, and this was only $3.99. So I was super happy to try. Oh, 35 in each. And then these are rose water, which I love rose water. And again, a two pack for $3.99, and there is 30 in each. So I thought that was super good. Good. Um, I did go ahead and splurge and I was they only had a couple of these Stila's and what I did was I got the one that I couldn't get the box open because I felt like if I got it open I would have tore it so that way no one else would have been able to get it open um, and it was in the color Sunset Cove and I did end up ripping it to get it open so it is a really, really pretty, like, color. And it was only, I think, what, $7.99? But I'm still scared, you know? Like, I don't know. But I know they're normally, like, $25 or something, right? It says compared to 12 but I'm pretty sure online they're, like, 25 But, I mean, it looks full. It looks brand new. It's not all dirty, and it doesn't, like... I don't know. I haven't even swatched it, but I will real quick because, man, this color looks, oh my good word. I just put way too much on. I didn't need to put that much on, but that, look at that shine. That is really pretty. That's going to be a beautiful topper. Okay, okay. I'm not mad at that. I'm actually really glad I got that now. So we'll, now we'll see, I guess, if I get a rash on my hand, I'll know that somebody was able to open it and check it, but it doesn't look like it looked all brand new. So, and again, that color is so pretty. It is Sunset Cove. So now I did get, there is a couple things coming. Um, and then now I am on a no buy. 
from here on out. And I did cancel Boxy Charm too, but we're keeping Ipsy and we're keeping Slay Glam Box, and obviously we're keeping Allure for now. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry, I know with no makeup, I'm like, ah, super scary, but that is so freaking pretty. That Stila, oh my gosh, I'm glad I grabbed that color. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Those Walmart boxes, the Allure box, my amazing free gift. One of them being this. Sorry, and I hope you enjoyed our little friend, and we'll see you guys soon.